Oh, real smooth. I'm not even trying yet. Yeah, I can tell. <laughs> and he doubted me. Pleasure to watch professionals at work. again. We'll still need these. Great. Good luck. We'll be in touch. Hands in the air. Hi, Victor. Hello, Nadine. <laughs> Pleasure to see you again. Only this time, I've got the drop on you. Well, I guess I should be glad that's not a real gun. <laughs> Hardly recognize you out of your fatigues. Yeah. You know how it is. Every once in a while, a job requires us to get all dolled up. Looking sharp, by the way. Not too bad yourself. Feels so out of place here. I can't tell you what a relief it is to run into another English speaker. Even if you are American. They'll have to blame my parents for that one. <laughs> I was on my way to the bar. Can I get you something? Yeah, scotch. On the rocks. Be right back. Date? You catch all that? Yes, I did. Sounds like a lady's trying to buy you a drink. Yeah, Nadine Ross is buying me a drink. Ross. Wait, doesn't she own that army for hire? Is it called Coastline? Shoreline. Yeah, right. But you had a run in with them. It's putting them mildly. Fortunately, she does not seem to be holding a grudge. I'm good to go here. All right. Listen, we're all set, Sully. You uh, stay out of trouble, okay? I'll try. You ready? <laughs> yeah, let's do it. You gotta find where the waiters and caterers are hanging out. Learn one out of the kitchen, probably. Then let's go find the kitchen. Man, there's enough food down here to feed a small town. I wonder if they host weddings. Crap. You see a waiter in there? Nah, just more heavily armed goons. What the hell is this? This gig wasn't on the blueprint. Locked, of course. Okay, plan B. up there. Nathan, come check this out. There we go. Let there be light. I'd like to go in this joint. <sighs> Don't suppose you brought a... Yeah, that'll do. It's always a good idea to bring a smoker along. Unless you need to run. Man, I'm starting to get a little drunk off the fumes in here. Now, good thing Sully's driving. Maybe the vent access is behind these casks. Good job. That's a lot of really rare vintage. Maybe Alcazar can just settle for some good wine. Hey, uh, 
Should we worry that Victor is chatting up the game, Ross? I mean, I've heard some pretty scary stories about her crew. Yeah, don't worry about Sully. I can talk his way out of anything. This way. Hey, look, the vents. That's our way out. Yep, let's find something to climb on. Yeah, I got it. No need to give me a hand or anything. I'm holding a lighter. Holding up lighter. Okay, up we go. Right there. That's smaller than it looked, huh? <laughs> and a lot more dusty. There's no shortage of waiters around here. Tanto non capirebbe la differenza. Questa Fresh air, here we come. Hey, check this out. See that building with the radio tower? You mean the cell tower? The what? Whatever. Listen, that's the power room. Yeah, you're right. Let's see how we get past this gate. Sam, up here. I'll boost you up. All right. All right. Good thing you kept in shape. Sully, we just got out of the wine cellar, heading to the power room now. How's it looking? Sully? You there? Ah, that must be a bad spot for a signal. Hopefully he's doing okay. Sam, look. Maybe we can use that and find a window. Drop into the kitchen. That's a good idea. <clears throat> Sarah. Ma che sta facendo? Easy on the civilians, Sam. What? Right. So he wakes up with a headache in his underwear. We've both been there before, right? <laughs> right. Well, I got mine. You get yours. All right. Okay, let's get to the power room. Sam, you good? Yeah, these pants are just a little bit too tight. Yeah, well, that's the style these days. Really? No, oh, we're in Rome. Nah, because we're in Italy. I get it. All right, I'm gonna head back to the ballroom. Not at all. <laughs> Sam, you there? Sam? Sully? 
great. Guys, if you can hear me, I'm just about at the power room. Should be there soon. Ish. If you got away with that. Oh, we did not. <laughs> no, we had our liberty taken away for a month. And what about the horse? Fortunately, we had a lot of carrots on board. <laughs> <laughs> Recognize someone? No. I thought I did, but no. But when am I finally going to meet that partner of yours? Drake? Well, that's ex-partner. Mm. Yeah, I've been flying solo for a while now. Drake's out. Oh, like dead out? Oh no, more like retired. Mm. Last I heard, he settled down, got married. Mm. Well, then he might as well be dead, right? <laughs> Victor Sullivan! Where the hell are you? Rafe? How long has it been? Ten years? Twelve? Fifteen. <laughs> it's amazing. All these years gone by, here we are, we're still haggling over dead people's junk. <laughs> really? Aren't you running your parents' business? My business now. But yes, that is my day job. <laughs> that is one hell of a day job. You could probably afford to buy up everything on the block tonight. Well, sure. But what would be the point in that? In these days, I'm only looking for the good stuff. Big score. Any advice on what I should pick up tonight? <laughs> yeah, I think I want to bid against him. <laughs> but, um, <clears throat> just between you and me, I did notice they changed the order. Hmm. I think somebody might be trying to rig this auction. Hmm. Well, remember where we are. This crowd didn't get rich by playing fair. Which is why you really need someone watching your back in a place like this. Ah. Well, I do hate to break it to you. You are working for an American. With? We've partnered up on this one. I see. <laughs> Talk about a power couple. In a few moments, we'll begin bidding on our next item, an inlaid wooden crucifix from the Trotty State. Well, I know when I'm a third wheel, you two kids have fun tonight. Just hold on, Sully. How'd you find out about it? It's... What it is that, Rafe? Nadine, I think your partner here has had too many bloody marriages. Cut the whole shit, old man. Now, I don't know how you scammed your way in here, but if you think about bidding on Avery's Cross, I can tell you exactly how you're going to be leaving in a goddamn Rafe! Fight. <laughs> well, you get my point. Lovely seeing you both. Nate? God damn it, kid, where the hell are you? Okay. Power room. I can do this.
God, why did I pick the power room? Ecco fatto. Oh, speriamo di non dover cambiare altri fusibili del cazzo stasera. Direi che per stasera può bastare. Ma che diavolo? Pronto? Che cosa? Here we go. Now, where the hell are the circuit breakers? Ah, oh, crap. Sam, Sully, you there? God damn it, kid, where the hell have you been? I made it. Had a few close calls, but... Yeah, well, if you're gonna cut the power, now would be a good time. Right, well, I'm gonna need a minute before I can reach the panel. We don't have a minute. Rafe's about to walk out of here with your cross. But what? Rafe? Rafe is here? Yes, Rafe is here, and as of right now, he has the highest bid. Well, I'll bid him. With what? I don't have that kind of scratch. Sully, we're stealing, remember? What if he calls my bluff? Uh, he won't. We have 90,000. Do I hear any more bids? Guys, if we do not get this cross, I am as good as dead. Yeah. Well, I end up with the highest bid. We're all dead. Sully, I need you to buy me more time. Since we have no other bids. Trust me. Going once. Going twice. Scott. Then we have 100,000 euros in the room. Thank you. Do we have any other bids? We now have 110,000 euros in the room. For a penny and for a pound. That bid brings Don't us worry. to 120. We'll be out of there in no time. I better be. Okay, just gotta smash the lock. Now the room has reached 130,000. Nope. We are now at 140. Nothing. Damn it. Your bid, signore, takes us all the way to 150,000 euros. There's gotta be something. Come on. Hey, man, uh, I'm starting to sweat bullets here. Yeah, Bidding give me a sec. 160,000 euros in the room. Signore's bid yes. takes 170,000. We are now at 180,000 euros in the room. <laughs> gotcha. Now need to all right, boys, I'm at the switch. You ready? As I'll ever be, Victor. Just a sec. The gentleman's beat, 200,000 euros. 500,000. Let's get the show on the road here. Uh, thank you. We have 500,000 euros in the room. Does the gentleman wish to bid again? Be worried there for a minute, Victor. Thought I might have to kill you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's ruin this asshole's evening. Anyone else? We are going once. Going twice. Then I shall sell it for 500,000. And ladies and gentlemen, please remain calm. The backup power will come on shortly. It's gone. <laughs> 
Move, move it! Get out of the way! Stop him! Hey, stop that guy! Fermo! What are you doing? You're letting him get away! You speak Spanish. Sam, tell me you got the cross. I got St. Dismas right here. You want to say hi? Yeah, we really kicked the hornet's nest down here. Ballroom's locked down, security scrambling. Hey, Victor, where's our getaway? Come to the driveway out front. Just follow the spotlights. I'll bring the car around. Aspetta, cos'è stato? Falso allarme. Maybe we should have brought guns. Come on. Forse c'è qualcuno. Cos'è stato? qualcosa sembra tutto a posto gotta climb and get a good vantage point merda se riescono a svegnarsela non ce la faranno li troveremo e li riempiremo di buchi ma sappiamo cosa fare resta concentrato d'accordo How we doing, Nathan? I'm on my way. Heading to higher ground to get my bearings. All right, see you soon. Yeah. the ballroom. Driveway's right in front. <clears throat> okay. Everything's fine. No one got a good look at me. Just gonna play cool. Stroll right on out of here. Oh. Scusi. 
You're not supposed to be back here. Well, neither are you. But I'll tell you what, I won't tell anyone if you don't. You have something I want, and you're going to give it to me. Really? Well, I'm flattered, but I'm afraid I'm spoken for. If you'll excuse me. I'm not in the mood for games. Give me the crucifix. Lady, you're lucky I'm a gentleman. Because if I were... You'd want. All right, fine. Just remember, I didn't want to do this. Let's see what you've got. Don't tell them. Nice try. I gave you that one. Free me. Come here. Now hand me the artifact. Do you know how many artifacts I've collected over the years? You're gonna need to be more specific. Let me see if I can clarify! I look. I'm still a little jet lagged. Oh, son of a... Have you had enough? Or do you want to keep being a smart ass? You know, you're breaking a lot of expensive stuff in here. If you're not careful, they're gonna kick us out of here. Alright, wait, wait! It's in my back pocket. Where is it? Right there! <laughs> All right, I'm at the car. Where the hell are you guys? Uh, I just met your friend, Nadine Ross. She's lovely. Yeah, well, there's total chaos out here. They're trying to keep it contained, but everybody's freaking out. I don't want to rush you, but hurry the hell up. Nathan, where you at? Good question. You? By the ballroom. Look for this round sign thing. It's on the way. Round sign thing. Check. Good news is I got a gun. See you soon. So. Okay. I'll meet you at the driveway. Just head towards the ballroom. All right. See you there. Victor, I'm kind of stuck here. Any ideas? Uh, the fastest way is through the ballroom. You said the ballroom's locked out. Yeah. Well, now that they know it's you guys, they cleared the place out. That right, ballroom it is. You get that, Nathan? Yeah. Got it.
Gli spari venivano da qui! Se tacciate l'aria! Figlio di puttana! Sappiamo che sta qui da qualche parte! Almost to the ballroom. Nathan, I'm pinned down in here. I can use a hand. On my way, Sam. Oh, good.
for this. Shit. What? It's empty. What? Oh, you're such an <laughs> asshole. It's your brother. All right. Skull and crossbones. Very good, sir. Xavier's insignia. What is this? Uh, Hodie mecum eris in paradise. Today you will join me in paradise. paradise. It's what Jesus said to St. Dismas on the cross, right? But what about these numbers here? What do, you, what do you make of this? It's some kind of code. Or a phone number. <laughs> Come on. The dates. Huh? Look. 1659. It's the year Avery was born. 1699. Let me guess. The year he died. Well, uh, by most accounts, yeah, but... It means we have... Date of birth, date of death, and... Paradise, which means we're looking for Avery's grave. It's St. Dismas's Cathedral. <laughs> Wait a second. Hasn't Rafe been scouring that site for ages already? Yeah, the cathedral. See these symbols? Yeah. These are found on old Scottish gravestones. Right. Right? Now, look at this. The layout of this place is really unusual. Uh. Here's the cathedral, but the graveyard it's way over here. Rafe's been focusing on the wrong area. Exactly. Guys, we're going to Scotland. All right, all right. Wait, wait up. You do realize that Rafe knows you're coming. Yeah, we can deal with that when we get there. Look, that psycho would like nothing better than for you to show up. Plus, he's got Nadine and her whole army to back him up. Yeah, but he doesn't have this. The biggest pirate treasure of all time is within our grasp. I thought this was about saving Sam. It is. 
Uh, come on, it's both, right? We need the treasure so we can save Sam. How is Elena cool with all this? Jesus, kid. Look, it's just not that simple. Look, with all that you two have been through together... She wouldn't understand this. You are not giving her enough credit. I can't take that chance. Nathan, he's right. Things have changed. Rafe's involved now, and... I can... I can take this on my own, really. Great. Well, thank you for your input, both of you. Excuse me. Hey. Hey, it's me, yeah. No, the reception's lousy. Yeah. Something on your mind, dear? Look, I, uh, I realize it couldn't have been easy, all those years away. And I'm sorry for what happened to you, but it's not his fault. I never said that it was. It took a long time for him to get out of this game. You see a gun to his head? He chose this. Okay, he's meant for this life. You really believe that? Why are you here, Victor? Because somebody's got to keep an eye out for him. No, I'll just see you in a few more weeks. Yeah, I will. Okay, I love you too. Bye. Just told her that the job was going to take a little longer than expected, which is the truth. Right? So come on, what do you say? Sam could still use our help. Well, <clears throat> I do hear that the weather is particularly fine in Scotland this time of year. Now, Rafe's really going all in, isn't he? Well, they're all concentrated around the cathedral, so that's good. Because we are going to have that graveyard all to ourselves. <sighs> Sully. Yeah? Hey, listen, we're good to go here. Okay, kid. Happy hunting. Nice chance to come with. Yeah, well, unless you can find me an escalator, I think I'll pass. <laughs> all right. See you in a few. Uh, hey, Nate. Yeah? Just, uh... Ah, just bring me back something shiny, will you? That's the plan. Well, let's go pay our respects to Captain Avery, huh? Scottish Cathedral. Strange place to bury your treasure, no? Well, not really. I mean, by the time Avery would have sailed here, the place was already abandoned. I guess that's true. Plus, with the massive bounty on his head, and a good place to hide. So, uh... What happened between you and Rafe? Nah, I couldn't deal with him. I'm pretty sure he'd had enough of me. I was still coming to grips with your uh, death and with his frustration from not finding the treasure. I'm pretty sure he was ready to kill me by the time I bailed. <laughs> Imagine what he want to do to you now. Yeah, <laughs> trying not to. Sam, listen. He's ruthless. I mean, even more so than when we teamed up with him. I mean, I've heard stories. Trust me, me too. All the more reason I don't feel bad about any of this. It's a long drop. Yeah. I need to find another way down. Hey, this should hold. Huh, good call. <clears throat> the hell is all this? It's excavation equipment. 
shoreline? What? Look. I thought they were just by the cathedral. Oh, hey, shit. Get out! <laughs> Okay, we're good. Yeah, nice to meet you too, Shoreline. Seems like they were expecting us. And like they're searching away from the cathedral. Which means we should get to that graveyard pronto. Exactly. Why didn't you guys search beyond the cathedral? Oh, we did, a little. But this place is so big, without knowing where to look, it's like shooting in the dark. Like blowing shit up in the dark. This place. Monks had several living quarters. Main one being by the graveyard, of course. <laughs> location, location, location. More shoreline equipment. Uh, at least no shoreliners. Well, maybe we'll get lucky and they'll blow themselves up. Careful with that stuff, huh? Hey, got the door open. That was very loud. Hopefully they didn't hear us. Uh, hopefully we just blend in with the other explosions. Look, there's a way up through the roof. That's too high for a boost, though. Oh, well, let's find something to climb on. Yeah. That door. You're pretty good with that stuff. Well, I've blown a lot of shit up over the years. Hey, we can use this to climb out of that building. Those guys Nadine warned us about. Either way, the orders are the same. Shoot to kill. Whoa! Shit! Someone's here!
All right, nicely done. That could have been bad. Yeah. Let's get out of here before anyone checks in on me. There. Come on, let's go. Got it. Oh, careful. Got it. Oh, careful. You think you can do that? What are you talking about? I taught you that move. All right, let's see it then. <clears throat> you see? Uh, that was clumsy. <laughs> Sam. There's a ladder just out of reach. Hey, hold on. I'll come over. All right. Give me a boost. Come here, I'll pull you up. There you go. Thanks. All right, there it is. The monk storm. Just a hop, skip, and a jump away. Uh, don't jinx us. Now we go. Ah. Burns a little. Huh. Well, those are fun. I could do this all day. Double to wipe the map. You go where the money leads you. It gets colder. I'm going to take a leak while you educate our young recruit you. So what happened next? Did he put down the robot? No. With our help, he kept it at bay. Nice Once one. money ran out... You get the left one. No reason for I got right. Oh, okay. Oh. Then I have to do better than that, fellas. Let's see if we can keep this up. You two done prepping the site? Cemetery is ready for rich boys this week. They're not slowing down, are they? Old lady wants the results, but she wants them yesterday. Have they found anything? Heard they uncovered some stuff, but I don't know the details.
You two done prepping the site? Cemetery is ready for rich boys' business. They're not slowing down, are they? The boss lady wants the results, and she wants them yesterday. Have they found anything? Heard they uncovered some stuff, but I don't know the details. Right beyond those walls. Oh, I'm not gonna jump this ravine. Gonna need to find another way around. Down we go. Ah. 